Cylinder issues wireless warning and increasing body of evidence suggests a significant health risk. Far from being a technophobia, Senator Colbrick, a former aerospace engineer, described himself as an early adopter of technological innovations, yet he feels the health risk of the current wireless technology have became too blatant to ignore, noting that wireless radiation has been linked with cancer, neurological problems, and reproductive damage. Senator Colbeck testifies as to his serious concerns about the price of health of high frequency wireless transmitters, cell phones, Wi-Fi routers, and smart meters. We're talking Senate Bill 637 is the Senate, Senate Bill. And what they're doing, they're installing 5G, the new 5G, and what it's doing uh, is sending uh, microwaves through the air and it's causing older people and young and real young kids to basically have uh, all types of bad situations where they go into the hospital, cancers and things of this nature. And uh, it's basically killing by the millions. And there you go, like the stones say, maintain humanity on the 500 million. And that's what it's doing. It's starting to kill. It's a holocaust of the U United States citizens even the little babies are being killed by the millions because of the radiation that the 5G is eliminating or putting out and old folks are being found inside their houses close to towers and of course they're not going to admit to this but 5G is killing a lot even the babies <laughs> 